What's up guys? In a previous tutorial I showed you how to change the icon of your flash drive in which cleverly I have uh, made an icon of my face and put it there. Uh, so anybody who steals this will see my face. Um, but today I'm going to show you how to change the name of your flash drive. Uh, many of you may know that going into properties allows you to change the name of the device itself. But if you want it to show up something a little more clever uh, and have more characters than just the eight that it allows you through properties uh, there is a uh, way to use the auto run file that I showed you how to make in the first tutorial uh, to actually do that uh, so the command we're going to be using is label and as you see I already have here uh, Matthew Sewell's USB drive uh, and I believe the limit for this is up to 25 characters so use them creatively I mean a lot of us have already had uh, practice with Twitter so uh, let me just change this to hello YouTube uh, just as an example and whenever we get that put in there label equals hello YouTube without any spaces uh, and we save uh, and we exit that out exit our flash drive out whenever we eject it and then put it back in we'll notice the name of the device has changed let me go back to PC to show it um, so you can freely change this have any characters in it have any uh, letters whatever you want in it spaces up to 25 characters I believe it is and it works and it's not what you have in properties so if you enjoyed this video and want to see more content like this feel free to subscribe give a thumbs up or leave a comment down below thanks for watching oh and I almost forgot to make the auto run INF file we have to create a new text document it doesn't matter what it is blah 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 whatever um, and to make the auto run file, we have to input auto run in brackets. And whenever we have that, we can put in the information that we had there before. Uh, and I'm going to change the label to what I want it to be. And whenever you have all of the information in there that you want, you go to File, Save As, and where the file name is we want to save this as type all files and we're gonna put it the file name to auto run dot inf uh, with no spaces and no capitals in it uh, and then we'll hit save so again if you enjoyed this video please feel to comment rate subscribe whatever that's the old YouTube saying but I'm gonna say it anyway and if this helped you in any way, let me know down in the comments. Thanks so much.